And so if they're a young child, typically it begins with social transitioning. That's the first phase that would be changing perhaps your name, your clothes, your restrooms, those types of things, a social external transition. The next stage would be puberty blockers. So these are drugs given to kids as young as eight years old to block the natural progression of puberty. Now, you're supposed to be hitting puberty at a certain time, and if you don't hit it, and puberty doesn't happen, it's actually a disease. It's called Kalman syndrome. And so medicine can then be given to induce puberty because it should be happening at this time. Essentially what they're doing with puberty blocking drugs is inducing a diseased state in the kids. And they say, wait, well, hey, puberty blockers have been used before and, and it has been for what's called precocious puberty. That's when a child hits puberty far earlier than they should. So they kind of hold it off until the right window of time and then they let puberty take its course. That's the way historically it had been used, but only for a very limited amount of time.